he is a senior dog, almost deaf, and he's been a shelter dog for 653 days. I'm Julie, and this is Snoopy's Story for GeoBeats. I'm a graphic designer based out of the Tri-Cities, which is in Washington State. I started volunteering for the Kennewick Shelter, which is the Ben Franklin Humane Society, where Snoopy is, for the last two years. (laughs) He was surrendered to the shelter. About a year ago, he was diagnosed with Cushing's disease. This gives him problems with his vision and his hearing, so he's almost completely deaf. Oh, what am I doing? He can't hear me. Whenever Snoopy has a blanket or a stuffed animal inside of his kennel, he sucks on the blankets and the toys. Oh, Snoopy. I think it makes him feel better. I started getting to know him in the last month, so that's when I started getting super attached to him. He is great with people, but he does not like other dogs. He enjoys just simple joys. When you let him out of his kennel, he's just like, this is the best day ever. And I love that you took me outside. He's not a high demand dog. He's not one of those dogs that you got to take out for a three mile hike. He just wants you to sit out in the backyard with him and lay out in the sun. Oh, thank you for another kiss. He has gotten so many amazing donations, gotten tons of toys. A very nice person noticed that he only had a blanket in there. They called the shelter and they got in this really nice orthopedic bed. So cute in your little bed. Yeah, you do. You do. You look so sweet. He is very bonded to one of the workers. Her name is Sydney. Snoopy is her absolute favorite dog. (laughs) The veterinarian says that he has a really good prognosis with those meds that he's taking. So hopefully he's got another few golden years left in him. Ooh, that was cute. Boy. I think with the cost of the meds, people know that this is an expensive disease to treat because there's regular vet visits and he's got several different types of meds that he's on. It's expensive. Excuse me, I got a present for you. When it's a senior dog and when they have special needs like Snoopy, it's kind of scary for people. They don't want to adopt a dog and then only have him for a few months. I'm going to be so incredibly excited when he finally gets to go home and I wish I didn't have two dogs of my own so that I could take him home. (laughs) He was in foster care for a little bit so he did get some shelter relief but unfortunately didn't work out with them so for almost that whole time he's been at the shelter for 653 days he has only had one meet and greet that i'm aware of he had one that was scheduled for last week but they didn't show up 